got me. He's got me. Uh oh. Oh yeah. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I just got that on film. We're gonna be right there between Redoubt and Iliamna Volcanoes. So right over by that slide mountain there, just off to the right. Okay, there's our boat and uh, Captain John. The uh, tractor has hooked up to the trailer and we are going to be launched into the inlet so we can make the run across to uh, Holly Creek. Check the anchor for yeah. me. Go check yeah. the anchor for me. Wish I could. Oh, wait. <laughs> oh, very funny. Feel better? A lot better. The anchor's doing just fine. Oh, good. I have my chest waders on, so I was able to jump off the boat. It's still about a foot deep, and uh, give you a little pano here. The tide is rolling out really quick, and all those clams are behind us. And below us. The only way this experience gets to be a more Alaskan is if you have a bush plane and you fly in and land on the sandbars here. It looks to be like a super cub and those things do not need much space to take off and land. So look at that. They are probably one of the coolest, most Alaskan planes around next to the uh, de Havilland Beaver. This is awesome. If you are looking for an Alaskan experience when you come up to uh, visit this place, even if you live here, it is a crime. Yeah. It's a crime not to come experience this. It's gorgeous. Yeah, and like I said, you know, if you, uh, the only way this could be more Alaskan is if you have a bush plane fly in like over there. That was pretty cool. Which I have done. Yeah, when you were a kid. Yep. My so, grandpa used to fly us out here. But it's gorgeous out here. I love it. So the name of the game is to look for the show. When I say show, it's going to be a little dimple in the sand. Uh, it can be recessed or even... Uh, concave. Concave. But uh, this is a picture perfect one right here. So, kind of see around it. And there's even a small show right there. But we're going to dig this one. We like to use uh, clam guns. The other alternative is a shovel. The gun is our uh, tool of choice here. So, go down, keep your finger off the hole, plug the hole. Go back down again, plug the hole. There it is. So just so you folks know, he's talking about a hole. See a hole on the bottom of the clam gun handle. So you put your hand over that to create a suction when you pull the sand back out of the hole and where you think the clam is. All broken clams. Yep. So, so there's the first one of the year. It's a tiny yeah, one. It was a baby. Alright, we'll see what else we can find here. There are three planes circling us right now. 
It almost feels like you're being swarmed. Well, as you can see, we're making some progress. We've got some nice, lovely hand size clams here. We've got some little ones too, but look at those beauties. Mm. And Ben is just digging away. Oh, it's exhausting. Yeah. That's a great little dance you got going on there. It's my happy clam. <laughs> there it is. Do I need to pick one up over here? No. Okay. Where did that one go? See how they try to dig back into the soil? But we won't let him. No! Ooh, boy, they really get a suction. <laughs> <laughs> And yeah, in the bucket they go. There it is. Ooh, that's a nice sized one. Squirter. I'll try to zoom in here and show you, but there are one, two, three, four, five, maybe six planes landed over there together. And then we've got a couple boats over here, but there are a ton of boats all along here. Everybody's out for the clam tides. Oh, there's the clam dance. Back and forth, around and round. There it is. The baby one. A little one. Check out this guy that we just picked up. He is huge. It's bigger than my hand. Look at that. Oh, oh. He's got me. He's got me. Uh oh. Oh yeah. Oh my goodness. <laughs> we just got that on film. Show it. Wow, that is huge. We just got a two for one special here. We have a butter clam and a razor clam. I noticed the uh, tide is starting to roll back in a little bit, so we are going to start working our way back to the boat. Because you do not want to be stuck out here when the tide comes in. Oh, I see it on the bottom. Now this is a huge workout doing this. There it is. All right. <laughs> We're gonna call this clam rally. There it is. I think you deserve a rest after that. That was like five clams in about two minutes. We're back at the boat and uh, everybody's on board, tide's rolling in, and we're gonna take a minute to uh, introduce John from JJ Smart Tartars. Hello, how you doing today? The, uh, the tide's coming in fast and the clams are aboard, so it's been a pretty successful day. You oh. See a picture? Yeah, the boat's hall of clams there. This is uh, part of Team Thorpe's clams today. Yeah, so it's a good it's haul. Good haul. How long have you and Joan been in business? Uh, we started guiding in 92. Okay. And, uh, started fishing up here when we came up in the 80s. Big fiberglass ski boat from Oklahoma. It was quite the deal in Oklahoma, not so much up here. But <laughs> we uh, slammed it with halibut and kings for three years until, until we started doing this. Good. 
Well, we really appreciate you taking us out today and uh, you guys got a great operation. We love staying at your uh, RV park. Space One is always our favorite. We gotta reserve it sometimes in advance. That's yeah, oh yeah. That's, it's the best view spot we got, that's for yep. sure. So uh, yeah, we're gonna let that tide roll in a little more till the boat's floating and work our way back to Deep Creek. It is really rolling in now. The uh, boat off to our port quarter. Looks like they're just about floating all the way, but nowhere near uh, capable of uh, dropping engines down. So yeah, there it goes. All this land is disappearing. We are back in Deep Creek and uh, just waiting for Marine Services to pull the trailer down and then uh, get out of the water and ready to clean some clams. We are back from the uh, clam charter with J and J Smart Charters, and uh, now the work begins cleaning those clams. Yes. So. Uh, our next video is going to be cleaning clams <laughs> and if you like this video be sure to give it the thumbs up and subscribe to our channel and thanks again for watching.